The following program contains dramatizations of real people and events. Some names and identifying details may have been changed. Seven months ago, Meredith was told by her doctor that she had a miscarriage. Now she has suddenly delivered a baby in an amniotic sac on her bedroom floor. And she didn't even know she was still pregnant. My water never broke. I mean, there were no signs to even lead to me thinking it was a child. I was told that we had had a miscarriage. Really can't even understand what just happened. I don't know. In rare cases, the woman may deliver without the rupture of the amniotic sac, and that would actually be delivery of the baby, the amniotic sac, the placenta, and the umbilical cord all in one unit. I didn't think it was alive. It was still in the sac. It wasn't moving. I just got horribly scared. I didn't know what to do. I just called 911. It was the only thing I could think of, really. As soon as the sac separates from the uterus, the baby is no longer getting oxygen from the mother. That sac needs to be opened, and the baby needs to be stimulated to start breathing on its own. Less than a minute later, it popped. With the sac ruptured, Meredith and Brandon can see that it's a baby girl inside. It wasn't moving. It was quiet. Didn't make any sound. I don't know, I don't know if it's alive. The operator asked me if there was a cord wrapped around her neck, okay. and it was. So I unwrapped it. Okay. Soon after that, I heard her start crying. I got do I, do, I do, do I pick him up? All I remember seeing is her little arm raise up. So I knew that she was alive. <laughs> it took the paramedics three to four minutes to arrive to the house. I'm going to cut the umbilical cord, OK? <laughs> We were taken in two different ambulances to the hospital. I was extremely nervous and scared. Can't believe we just had a baby at the house. 